let me explain the assignment. This assignment is designed to help you practice all the skills that you've learned so far in the course. You'll learn how to use the processing tools along with the model to be able to create an automated workflow. The assignment is to take the workflow we did in the first part of our first module, where we took this data layers of roads and computed the total lengths of national highways. We want to now automate this process and say, can we build a model? So your assignment will is require to create a model that takes three inputs, a roads layer. So you will take the major roads layer to test this model. You'll work with the same Karnataka.geo package that is there in your data package. You take the roads layer, take the districts layer, and you have an option here. Do you want to compute the length of national highways or state highways? Remember the national highway starts with NH, state highways start with SH. So now we have that as a parameter. So you can have a model which says, select the input as state highways, it'll compute the length of state highways. Compute the length of national highways, it'll compute the length of national highways. This type of input is called an enum. Let me show you in your model. So in the model, if I have an input called enum and you can have this items where you can say type one, type two. And you can see when I see the model, you have this drop down which you can select either option one or option two. So this is what we want as a state highway or national highway as the input to your model. So you'll create this, you'll take this data, you'll run through the process where we compute the length of national highways, we extract the national highways or state highways, we compute the lengths, we do a spatial join with the districts layer, we done to statistics by categories, and we finally generate a tabular output that looks like this. So once you run this, you should get a table for each district, what's the length of national highways or state highways that you selected. So this will allow you to practice the workflow along with the model. So try this out. It's going to be a bit challenging than the class challenges that you've done, but we hope that it's going to help you really practice and discover all the gaps in your knowledge when you are learning about model.